Hello friends, this is your friend Rakesh. Today we will learn how to achieve total labels. We mostly see in every stacked bar chart, you will not be able to add labels for the total bar. Meaning we can add theta labels to the all the stacked bar, but for the whole column, we won't be able to add the data labels to the whole column to achieve that result as I have achieved in my screen. So I will teach you how to achieve this result with a very uh, easy trick. So for that purpose we have to first add a we will first add line and stack column chart this one and then we will first enter into the focus mode. This is the blank canvas that we have. I will add all the required fields. I will add sales in columns as well as in line. Okay, so this is correct. So this is the line and text column chart. So first we have to add the data labels. Yes, we have it. We are getting data labels for total bars as well as this text. So yes, we we are getting data labels, but we are getting data labels for all the data columns. But we, what we want the data labels for the total bars only. In order to get that result, we have to go down and here in the customize series first we have to enable it. Then here we have to decide for what all data points we want to show data labels and where we do not want to show data labels. For consumer, we do not want to show data labels. Then again, in corporate, we do not want. For home office, we do not want to show data labels. And for the sales, yes, we want to show data labels and we are getting it. For few of the bars, we are not getting the, the data labels at the top of the bar. To get that, so we have to go a little down and decide the position of the data labels. So we have we will select the above. And yes, as you can see, we are getting the data labels for all the bars at the top of it. So this is the data labels for the total. A total data label. Now the main part how we are going to hide the line. So to hide that we have to go to the shape and the shape we will reduce the stroke width to zero and this and our line will disappear. So this is the result that we want. Now in order to make your total values visible we will make use of the show marker and see it is now giving the correct figure that we or, or the result that you want to achieve. There might be a situation where few of the folks might not get the appropriate result. So this is, this might happen because of the alignment of the secondary axis with the primary axis. To do that, we will first have to enter into the y-axis. And in the y-axis, we will go a bit down. And here, we have to enable the show secondary axis. And we have to align the zero so this will resolve that issue this is the result that we want to achieve thanks for joining